Mark Rogers TV here at American Athletic Conference Media Day, joined by Cameron Malvo, defensive end for Houston, 13 and one campaign. You probably understand that not a whole lot of people out there expected that kind of performance. Uh, and uh, you guys had to be extremely psyched once uh, that bowl victory was in the uh, in the bag. Uh, yeah, yeah, we are. And um, yeah, that was great for the university. And of course, we, we, we got into the national spotlight. So I mean, that was pretty exciting, you know, bring something back to University of Houston. But I mean, that has nothing to do with this team. Coach Herman says it all the time. That was last year's championship team. This year, we're just a team that we got to find out who we are, and that's coming in the fall camp. Okay, we'll get to 2016. One more question about 15. The we the perform the, the the performance against Florida State was pretty amazing. Dalvin Cook's one of the best in the business. You guys completely uh, contained him, uh, contained the passing game. Just a remarkable effort against a very talented Florida State offense. Uh, just your thoughts about that performance and how it could possibly carry into the spring and into this season. Um. Well, the good thing about that game, you know, yeah, we stopped them, and yeah, that, this and that. But, I mean, the the good thing about that is that we came into this season with maybe more momentum. You know, it's always good to end, end, end the season with momentum, but that's really it. I mean, past that, nothing that we did back then is, correlates any way now is what I'm saying. So, it doesn't really matter. Exactly. So, how does Coach Herman get that across to the team to make sure, hey, we forget about going 13-1, and one. it's all about today because everybody's 0-0 now? Literally, we, li we live it. Like, uh, we, we can't say Peach Bowl around, around the facilities. We can't wear Peach Bowl gear. We can't uh, a conference championship. Can't talk about any of that. We can't wear that gear. So, I mean, it, 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 it is behind us. And uh, whenever we started our uh, winter conditioning, we had question mark shirts and all that because, I mean, really this team didn't accomplish anything. So it was just instilled in us early, and we all believe in it. We know what Coach Herman accomplished at Ohio State as an offensive coordinator. Then he comes to Houston. You guys uh, are one of the top teams in the country. Uh, what makes him such a successful football coach? I, I think it's his consistency. You know, he comes with the same exact – uh, type of attitude every day, probably the most self-driven person I know. Um, really flat out, just knows what he wants and goes and goes and gets us. And and he's great at bringing people along with him. You know, I mean, not many coaches can just come in the program and change the whole culture and like the mindset of the entire team just like that. So I mean, that normally takes time. But Coach Herman did a great job of of, of getting everybody on board. So I think that was the main thing that makes him successful.